Hi, I'm Mira from Flow with Mira. Welcome to beautiful island of Belitung in Sumatra, Indonesia. And special thanks to Sheraton Belitung Resort for the beautiful space for today's class. So let's get started. We're going to start the class standing on the front of the mat. Standing nice and tall with your feet hip width distance apart, approximately about a fist between your heels. Lifting up the spine, reaching up to the sky, arms dangling by the side. We inhale and we exhale. We're going to start with the roll down. So we're going to tip the head down, softening through the knees and continue rolling the spine down, vertebrae by vertebrae. Take it down to the floor. Tip the pelvis forward to bring the body a little closer to the floor. Inhale. Exhale, let's roll the spine up. Stacking up the spine, vertebrae one at a time, coming up to the beautiful tall position. Inhale. And exhale. As we tip the head down and we soften through the knees, articulate the spine, and then bring the pelvis forward a little bit. And bring the body closer to the floor. Inhale. Exhale. We roll up again. And lifting the spine nice and tall. Again. One last one. In breath. Exhale. We roll down. Bring the pelvis forward. And in this time, I'd like you to place your hands down to the floor. Maybe soften the knees a little bit more. Now I'd like you to just do into a little dip squat here. Folding deep through the hip joint and the knee joint. And then press up again. Lift up. Again. Softening through the knees. Folding deep in the hip joint and the knees. And then press up. Again. Two more. Inhale. Exhale. Last one, inhale. And an exhale. And then another deep fall here. I like you to bring the weight over to your hands and bring the knees down. Just readjust the position if you need to on the mat. So you are in a sort of modified quadruped position here. Align the shoulder and the heel of the palm here. Keeping the spine nice and long and tuck the toes under. Exhale, into little cat stretches. We round. Inhale. Into neutral spine and then take it further into a back extension. Exhale. Into flexion. In breath. Into slight extension. Exhale, pressing the floor away into a flexion. Inhale, lifting through the spine. Take it up into a slight back extension. Last one, exhale. Inhale, nice and tall. And then exhale into flexion again. And stand this flexion here. I like it to sort of. Bring your weight onto your feet now. So push away with the hands. And then transfer your arms back behind the bottom. Sit the pelvis down. And then bring the feet forward. Okay. Arms along in front of you. Lifting tall. Have your feet still in the hip width distance apart. I've been attacked by flies here. <laughs> Inhale. Exhale. Round in the back. And then roll back. To the floor. Maybe take yourself to a chest lift position. Inhale. Exhale. Pull in the center. Bring the body over your pelvis. Lift the spine. You know what? Let's take the arms out to the sky as well. And arms out to the side. And arms forward as we go into a C curve. We roll back. Take yourself down to a chest lift position. Inhale. Exhale. Sending the body up and over. Lifting up through the spine, arms up to the sky, arms out to the side, and then rounding the back, seeker. We roll back again to a chest lift, in breath, exhale, lifting up, arms out to the sky, round the back, last one here, roll back, in breath, exhale. Rounding over, lifting up through the spine, arms out, 
and then arms forward. Last one here. We will transition ourselves down to the ground to a chest lift. Now stay in the chest lift position. Walk your feet closer towards your bottom. Arms down by the side, head down for the pelvic curl. We breathe out. Exhale, and you roll up through the spine. That's straight away. Inhale here. As you exhale, lift the arms up and then roll the spine down and bring your arms overhead at the same time. Inhale, exhale. Let's roll the spine up and then bring the arms up and then bring it down towards the feet side. Inhale, exhale. Roll the spine down and take your arms overhead. Again, in breath. Exhale, roll the spine up and bring your arms down to the feet side. Again, exhale, roll the spine down, arms overhead. And last one, exhale, roll the spine up and bring the arms down by the side on towards the feet side. Press the arms down a little bit more and then lift the pelvis a little higher. Now engage those inner thighs. I like it too. We're gonna do alternate hip drop here. So release the right glute, right bottom. Allow the right hip to tip down. So you're in a rotation position here and then press it up again. And then release the left glute and allow the pelvis to rotate or dip down on the left side. Exhale, we press up. And under right glute release, right pelvis tip down and lift and lift. Exhale, press. Your arms are active and lift. Your thighs, your hamstrings are working here and lift. Again, in breath. Exhale. And in breath. Exhale. One more each side. Exhale. Last one. Exhale, lift high and roll the spine down, down, down. Float your right leg up to the tabletop. Bring your left hand pressing against the thigh. Take an in breath. As you breathe out, I'd like you to push the thigh up and then press the arm down, the left arm down at the same time. So let's go. Press it for five, four, three, two, one. One, drawing the abdominal tight and then release. One more time. Exhale, press up and push down. Abdominal sinking in for five, four, three, two, one, and release. Okay, lift the left leg up to tabletop. Right palm against the left thigh. And as we breathe out, drawing in the abdominal muscle in and then press down and push up at the same time for five, four, three, two, one and release again exhale four five four three two one and release interlacing the hands at the back of the head in breath ready for the chest lift exhale we'll lift the chest inhale exhale again exhale we'll lift in breath Exhale, we come down and exhale, we lift in breath. Exhale, two more times. Last one. Inhale, hold. I want you to exhale to lift the right leg up. Now, take an in breath. As you do the next exhale, do leg changes for me. Again. Three. Two. One. Stay. Keep the left foot down, keep the right leg up. Reach the arm in between the thighs. Now from here, I want you to rotate your trunk over to the outside of the right thigh. Now hold the leg in tabletop. From here, lift the chest up a little higher and let's do 10 pulses. We lift, two, three, four, five, six, 
seven, eight, nine, ten. Back to center. Hands behind your head. Leg changes. And keep the right foot down. Arms forward. Rotate to the left. The ass of the left thigh. And again, ten pulses. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Center, arm back, both legs up to tabletop again. Release the head down and slide your arms out to a T position. Drawing the center nice and deep for the spine to a supine. Let's rotate towards me as we inhale. Exhale, center. Inhale, rotate from the waistline. Keep the legs together. Exhale, anchoring the shoulders firmly down to the ground as we rotate. We exhale, recruit the abdominal deep to bring the legs back to center. And we inhale. We exhale. One more each side, in breath. Exhale. And last one in breath. Exhale. And center. Lifting the head and the chest up, grabbing that shin with the arms or the hands. Lift the chest a little higher, ready for double leg stretch. Inhale, reach. Exhale. Draw in. Inhale, reach. Exhale. Pull in. Inhale, reach. Exhale. Inhale, reach. Exhale. Last two, reach. Exhale. Last one, reach. Exhale. We stay. Now just drop the feet a little bit. Press your hands against the legs and then press the legs against the hands on the arms. Lifting up. We're going to rock up. Rock up. Three more rock. And we come up to sitting position. Two. Last and sitting up well done let's go to rolling like a ball here so balancing on your tailbone grab the legs nice and firmly use your arm muscle looking down to the pelvis here then we inhale we roll back exhale center inhale roll back exhale center again Two more times. Last one. And stay. Can we find a balance? Draw the center in. Release the shoulders in breath. Now as we exhale, I'd like you to press your legs against your arms a little bit firmly now and roll away. So roll the spine away from the legs and take the legs back up to that table position. Okay. Extend the left leg long. Hands on the right leg. Lift the chest a little higher for single leg stretch. And then we breathe out. Change. Change. Two more sets. Last set. Back to the right leg. Stay. Interlace your hands behind your head, ready for the crisscross. We rotate to that bent knee, which is my right leg. And then we all rotate over to the left. And switch. And switch. And switch. Three. Change. Two. Change. Last. Change. Return the legs back to the middle, release the head down, lower one foot down, second leg down. I like you to stretch your legs long. I'm just going to shuffle myself. And then take your arms overhead. Ready for the roll up. So squeeze it in the thighs nicely, tightly. And inhale as so you take the arms out, lifting the chest. Exhale, pull into the center and get yourself into that C curve position. 
and in breath. Exhale as you pull away the abdominal, articulate the spine away from the legs, get the sacrum down on the floor, lower back on the floor, and then take your arms overhead again. Inhale, we lift. Exhale, we pull deep, 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 deep into that C curve, in breath. Exhale, we roll down and sink that belly to the floor and take the arms overhead again. Inhale, exhale, lifting up into that C curve, in breath. Exhale, roll down. Sacrum on the floor, lower back on the floor, then take your arms off with you. Last one here, inhale, lift. Exhale, into that seeker, in breath. Exhale, let's roll back, roll back, roll back. And then let's open your arms up to a T position. Bring the right leg up to the sky. Dorsiflex the foot, put a leg circle, stabilize the pelvis, Dig deep into the abdominal. Let's go across the body and down. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Last one. Center hole. Other way. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Two more sets. Last set, stay, point your foot like ballerinas, lift the head and the chest up, grab the back of the leg. Now I'd like you to pull the leg closer to your face for a little quick hamstring stretch here and stay for five, four, three, two, one. Release that, open the arms to the T position, bend the knee, take the foot down, bring the left leg in, straighten the right leg out. Left leg up to the sky, dorsiflex. Let's go across the body as you inhale. Exhale, inhale, exhale, stay parallel. In, exhale, exhale. Last set, exhale, stay whole, and then reverse. Inhale, Two more sets. Last set. Stay, point your foot, lift the head and the chest up, grab the back of the leg, pull it closer to your face. Release the shoulder. Stay here for five, four, three, two, one. And then arms out, back the knee, release the foot down, bring the other leg in. Arms long by the side, ready for our shoulder bridge prep. So, your feet are hip width distance apart. Exhale, we roll the spine up to that bridging position, pressing the two tip of the shoulders down to the floor. Press the arms firmly to the floor, lift the pelvis a little higher. Let's take the right leg up to tabletop. We hold that, find the balance, and then we lower the leg down. We exhale, and down. Exhale, and down. Exhale. Three more. Two more. Last one. Hold. Can we roll the spine down? Curling down, curling down, curling down. And then roll it up again. Curling up, 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 up. And then release the right foot down. Re-establish the pelvis, firmly press the right foot, take the left leg up to the tabletop. And we go, inhale, exhale, in breath, exhale, in breath, exhale, in breath. Three more sets. Last, hold. And then bring the foot down, reestablish the pelvis. And an exhale. Let's roll. Let's roll. Let's roll. Let's roll. Brilliant. Float one leg up to tabletop. Second leg up to tabletop. Stretch your legs long to the sky. Hold that center in. We're going to do a little corkscrew here. So 
Like spine to supine, we're going to rotate the lower body to the right. And then we're gonna bring the leg away to the left and center. Let's go to the left. Exhale, over to the right and center. To the right, exhale and left and center. To the left and center. Last set here, right and center and left and center bend the knee lower one foot down second leg down stretch your legs long on the mat take your arms overhead for the roll-ups inhale we lift i am not in the middle <laughs> make sure you are in the middle and then exhale roll up through the spine and lifting up the back all right let's grab those ankles we're going to do modified open leg rocker and if you are familiar with open leg rocker, you can come and join me for the full open leg rocker. So let's grab the ankles. Arms are straight, back is long. So your body is just slightly tipping diagonally backward here. Okay, what most important is your arm needs to be straight here. So power through the arms, inner thighs nice and active. Okay, let's go. We inhale as we round the back. Exhale, find that beautiful balance. Inhale, rounding. Exhale, lengthening through the spine. What's really gonna help you to balance here? Engage your latissimus dorsi, just muscles on the side, your wing muscles on the side of the rib cage. And inhale, exhale. One more for the modified version. Inhale, exhale. All right, and then we're gonna straighten one leg. Second leg, they can be slightly bent to your maximum knee extension here. So again, engage the lat muscle on the side. All right, when you're ready, inhale, exhale, lifting up. Again, inhale, exhale, lifting tall. In breath, exhale, lifting tall. And two more. Exhale, lift, lift, lift. Last one. Exhale, lift, lift, lift. Now bring the legs together, whether they're straight or bent, just bring them together, whole squeezing the inner thighs tight. Let go of the arms, find your balance, take your arms to the sky, stay there for five, four, three, two, one, and let it go. Excellent. Face knee, please. On your forearm for the side kick. You can have your hand in front of you like so. You can have your hands behind your head. So choose a position that is suitable for you today. Either way is all good. Hold the center. Stretch the leg along. Dorsiflex. And let's go forward. Exhale. Inhale. Two more set. Last set. Stay. Reach the arm away from the top leg. Lengthen forward, lengthen backward. Pull in the center. Stay there for five, four, three, two, one. Bring the leg together. Tuck the knees in. Lifting the underneath arm. Reach up to the sky. Side bend over and let it go over to the other side please forearm down top arm behind the head or in front of you here if you need a little bit more support but you really need to lift that underneath waistline up okay let's go reach the top leg long dorsiflex let's go forward inhale exhale inhale Two more set. Last set. Stay back. Reach the top arm away. Lengthen forward. Lengthen back. Stay there. For three, two, one. 
bring them in, tuck the knees in. Underneath arm, lifting up. Side bend. And let it go. Let's go to a quadruped position here. So align the shoulder and the heel of the palm. Such a beautiful place here. If you have a chance, come and visit the Belitung Island in Sumatra. Definitely stay with the Sheraton Resort in Belitung. Gorgeous location, gorgeous place. Okay, let's get back to work here. So, power through the arms here, lifting up that center. Right, let's go to a cat stretches here. So as you breathe out, we're going to recruit the abdominal and then we're going to round the back or flex the spine. And then going through neutral, reaching through the upper back, taking our back into an extension. Neck is long. Exhale, rounding. And through neutral, inhale, extend, exhale, rounding. And then through neutral, inhale, last set please, exhale, rounding. And then through neutral, inhale, lifting. And then go back to that neutral position, lower the right arm down, the right forearm down here. Okay, so you have one arm, one hand on the floor, another forearm on the floor. Stretch your left leg long. Pull in the center, lifting the left leg up and lower. Two more, lifting and lower. Last one, lifting, stay. Now circle the left leg out, tap to the side. Bring it up and then tap to the floor. Bring it up and then tap to the side. Bring it up and then tap to the floor. And then up and then tap to the side. Up and then tap for behind you. And then lift and then tap to the side. Lift and then tap behind you. Last two and then side. Up and then back. Last one and then side. Up and then back and lift and let's bring it to the side again here hold that let's do 10 little lift here and lift up 10 9 8 7 6 5 4 3 2 1 hold up and then circle it back behind you and bring it in well done okay let's switch the arm left forearm down right hand down stretch right leg long we lift for two and then one find that balance and let's go to the side tap bring it back and behind you lift it up and to the side and then up and then behind you and left to the side tap up and then behind you and then left to the side tap and then up and then behind you, and then left, and a side, and then up, and then behind you. Two more times, and a side, up, and behind you. Last one, and a side, up, and then behind you. Bring it up again to the side for the 10 left. Up 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, four three two one lift bring it back and bring it down and then bring it in okay i like you to stretch your left leg out to the side again press that foot down now i need to sit the pelvis back and then stretch your arms forward stay here inhale exhale one more and then Back to the quadruped, bring the leg in, other leg out, foot down, sit the pelvis back, stretch your arms along, in breath, exhale, one more, exhale, and then come up, quadruped, and let's take ourselves down to the floor. Okay, let's go. Let's go into single leg kick and then let's go to swimming here. So gliding the shoulder blades down, engaging through the middle back, abdominal and power through the legs here. Neck is long. Let's float those legs up and let's go right leg 
sh, la, sh, sh, and inhale, and inhale, and exhale, sh, sh, and, and, sh, and, sh, sh, two more set, sh, last set, sh, And stretch your legs long, squeeze in the inner thighs, and still power through the middle back, neck is long, and release the body down. Stretch your arms long, floating off the floor, neck is long and reaching away. Right arm, left leg, left arm, right leg, right arm, left leg for the swimming, left arm, right leg, and let's go. Inhale, exhale, in breath. Exhale, in breath, three more sets. Last set. Hold and release down. Good job. Bring the forearm to the side of your body. We're just gonna do a little swan here. So inhale, exhale, just recruit the abdominal again. And then the next inhalation, glide the shoulder blades down, lift the upper back into your maximum thoracic extension and then push through the floor. Lift up to wherever you can. You don't have to be fully extended with the arms. You can just be halfway and that's absolutely fine. Look forward and ahead, onto the horizon, and then descend the elbows down. Coming down, and we do it again. Inhale, glide the shoulder blades down, lifting through the back. Find that maximum thoracic extension, and then push the flow away. Don't forget the abdominal, use them. And then, coming down. And two more times. Inhale, lift, and push the floor, lift the spine, exhale, come down, last one, inhale, and push the floor, and come on down, and beautiful work, okay, let's push the belly in, or pull the belly in, push the floor away, round in the back, get yourself into that rest position, Give your back a little break here. Inhale. Exhale. One more breath. Exhale. All right. Tuck your toes under. Lift the pelvis up to an upstretch position. And lifting high through the sitting bones. Neck is nice and easy. And then release the heels down for a deeper stretch through the back of the legs. We breathe in here. Exhale. Again. Exhale. Last one. Exhale. A little prancing with the legs on the feet, lifting the right heel up. And then we switch left, right heel up. And then left. And then right. And then left. And right. And a left, two more sets. And a left, last set. And a left, both heels right up, to, nice and high. And release the heel down. Get yourself to a quadruped position again. We've got front support and leg pull back here. All right, now I'd like you to recruit the abdominal nice and tight here, lengthening through the lower spine. Reach the right leg out, tuck the toes under. And then left leg, tuck the toes under, neck is long. Bring the right leg in and stretch out. Left knee in and out. Right, left, right, left, right, left. Last set, last one. And stay, point your right foot, strong in the arms. Lift the right leg up, five, four, three, two, 
one hand switch left two three four five and another up stretch here lifting up to the sky and lowering the heel down and bring the knee down and then come right up okay arms up to the sky on a kneeling position i like you to power through the hamstrings and the glute forward drawing the center let's take i'm gonna take my left arm down to the heel press down or press a hand down or reach your arm down and I'll reach up to the sky for five four three two one use the hamstring use the glute use the abdominal lift the arm up and then other side right arm down right hand to the heel left arm to the sky reach out stay five four three two one power through the leg abdominal lift up and release the bottom down stretch forward again for another rest position inhale exhale in breath exhale last one here in breath exhale and in the next exhalation let's roll the spine up sitting nice and tall take a moment for two sets of deep inhalation and exhalation we inhale one more and let that go well done thank you for joining me today and not a special thanks to sheraton bulletin resort for the beautiful location for today's class i wish all of you a wonderful day thank you congratulations on completing the class well done i'm mira and i'm here to help you to look and feel your absolute best through pilates if you enjoyed this video you will love my free better postures in five days program click the first link in the comments and sign up i will instantly send you a daily email with a 15 to 20 minute workout each day this workout will work your whole body to help open stretch and strengthen your posture your spine and body will love you don't forget to like and comment with any question you may have about pilates subscribe and turn on notification so you don't miss any of my free Pilates video. See you in the next class.